lost my job for seven weeks. And because I had been living practically paycheck to paycheck, um, I technically had a job within a few days after losing it. But the difference in pay, um, it took seven weeks or so for it to adjust. And because of that, I lost my apartment, I lost my car. Uh, in December, Chris was laid off from his job and without transportation, it's almost impossible to find a job in the warehouse industry and no job, no money, no, <laughs> no place to live. Well, I lost a job. I, had, I was laid off from a job. Um, living uh, paycheck to paycheck and I didn't qualify for unemployment for several weeks. And so consequently didn't have the rent money for January. It was it was tough. I got evicted from my, my apartment um, the first part of March. And when I lost my home, it was my home. It was just an apartment, but it was where I lived. And it was very emotionally difficult. Money Smart through FDIC is a very valuable set of lessons. It gives you an opportunity to see where you fell off the tracks. And it could have been that I never learned to budget properly or save properly. Um, it, it's really taught us a lot about, you know, more about the budgeting, um, you know, what to look for when you open a savings account or a checking account. Uh, it was things I thought I knew, but didn't. I really hate looking at money issues, and I must say that I have grown, and I have a lot more self-esteem because I am really being accountable, not just pretending to be. Now, you know, we've learned how to budget money. Allowing us to have to track our expenses now has taught us to look at what we're spending and to notice, well, some things aren't exactly necessary right now. I had originally started with an IHN program in New Jersey. However, because they knew that I was looking to transition to the Midwest, they suggested that I look up other organizations. And you guys were the first one that I called and happened to have an availability not only for me and my daughter, but for me alone until my daughter gets here. Well, we were previously at a, another shelter. The experience there was terrible. They actually have a park right across the street from the shelter that is known to be a known drug hangout and things like that. We felt it was a completely unsafe environment for our children. I was real grateful that there was a place that I could go that was safe. And that wouldn't make me feel like a failure because I really felt like one. Fortunately, there's organizations like IHN that offered assistance even though I had an income. Overwhelmingly happy with the experience since then. It's just been a safe environment and wonderful for the kids and everyone's been just so welcoming and friendly and we couldn't have asked for a better experience. Even though I am in a good place, I want to go on. I want to move on. Uh, I've been treated with such respect and dignity and it really has restore my uh, faith in myself, I guess. And uh, it's good to know so many people care. All of the volunteers and all of the people that like make this run, it's kind of like a miracle. There's a lot of people that put all of their heart and soul into this program and I wouldn't be the person that I am today without going through this. I wasn't, I didn't really have a relationship with God then and now I've gone through so much these how many years, three, three years, like completely different person. Like I, ha I do have a relationship with God now and I go to church. And I want other people to know, like, you know, it's, um, it's hard to struggle. 
and it's scary to be like, oh my goodness, I'm going to be in a homeless shelter, you know? But, like I said, if, if everybody could experience at least this one, you know, there would be a lot more people that are just stable and happy, and it's, it's an experience that, you know, if everybody could experience being in the shelter, there would be so many great people in this world. I feel like I'm a much better person because of the experience, and it was the greatest experience of my life, and I would do it a thousand more times.